What is going on guys? Today we're looking at the Sidhu ABM084 and before I begin this video, I want to give a huge shout out to Apple Maker for sending me this product for review. Like always, I was not paid to say anything in the video, so everything here will be my honest opinion. The product was sent via DHL to the states and was wrapped in a lot of bubble wrap to make sure that this was safe and sound. It will also contain the box and a quick card to show you some small info on Apple Maker. The keyword I got came as a full package, meaning that it has everything to get going and start right out of the box. It's quite nice for $90 because the unboxing experience really makes you feel like you're excited to take out the next item. Included was of course, the keyboard, a keyboard cover, a manual, keycap and switch puller, and lastly a Type-C cable that is average at best, but if you don't have one, it's perfect that it comes included. To be honest, I'm not going to even mod this keyboard because right out of the box, it was amazing. The keyboard is featured with TTC hot swap sockets, and this is one of my first times using them, so I can't say how long they'll last, but so far they've been great. As a nice little small addition, they even come included with some little novelties to make sure that you can switch around the look of your keyboard, especially for free, this is a nice plus. This version I got came with pre-lubed Gateron yellows. By term, they're called Gateron Pro yellows. I did not notice any huge difference between hand lubing these or getting these stock. Gateron really did an amazing job getting these out the factory and how good they are and how good they sound. It's really interesting to see a TKL come to the market with the knob. Not only that, it was only $90 as well. You get three modes of connection, which is USB, USB wireless, and Bluetooth. Another great feature on the keyboard is the included Cherry PBT keycaps. Usually you get interference with north facing PCBs and Cherry keycaps, but there was none here. It made the experience very enjoyable. Now this is a controversial topic, but it also has clip-in stabilizers. To my experience, if you tune them correctly, they sound just as good as screw-in stabilizers. Whether that's a huge downside or not, well, that's up to you. The keyboard is also included with foam, so if you like that kind of sound signature, this is definitely the keyboard for you. And the knob itself is not normal either. Like usual, you could change your sound with the knob, but if you long press it, it changes the mode where you can also change the backlighting. To my experience, it's actually a pretty useful feature. Like I said before, a lot of these budget type of keyboards come with these two stage feet and while it's getting a tiny bit old, it's something I'll miss if they ever take it out. Because honestly, I love fine tuning my angle of typing to get that comfortable feel as my wrists do get kind of tired over time. I won't go over the software in this video because I don't ever use software. However, just by a glance, you can do so much more with it than if you left it stock. You can remap keys, create macros, and change a bunch of RGB features on the keyboard. On the side, you'll see switches to go from Windows to Mac, and also to turn on the wireless function as well. Shown next will be some sound samples of the switches that come with the keyboard. The Gateron yellows really give a nice smooth sound. Here's a long pole tactile as well. The keyboard comes with some great onboard lighting features, and if you go through the FM plus insert, home, etc., you'll be able to change any lighting feature just quickly and without having to go through the software. FM plus up and down will be able to change the brightness as well. All in all, it's a great out of the box experience. I tuned the stabs to be cleaner, but otherwise there's nothing to complain about. This also leaves room for great modding, and if you want to go down that in the end, you can. That's all I have to say for you today, and until next time.